I trust you have good news for me. That depends on your perspective. What is that supposed to mean? Well, his next of kin probably aren't thrilled. The local vultures are delighted, though. Wait, is that some sort of idiotic way of telling me you killed him? Ah, uh, yeah. I thought it was pretty o- You goddamn moron! I told you to deliver a message, not slice him up. I didn't want him dead, I wanted him on my fucking payroll! I'm not so sure about that. He was pretty far gone. Don't tell me my business! If I want someone killed, I'll say so! Have I got something for you? Hella fucking Luya! Now where the fuck are my tapes, man? Right here! Just out of curiosity, what are you doing with these? That's a lot of porn, even for you! Actually, I'm gonna set them on fire. You have something that belongs to a friend of mine. Everything here used to belong to someone else. Now it belongs to me. No shit. What about my ass? Does that belong to you too? It will by the time we're finished here. Quite the contrary. It is you who will belong to my ass. You gotta work on that one. Yeah, that didn't come out as cool as I thought it would. Your customers are into some pretty fucked up stuff, Larry. Oh, I am not one to judge. As long as you ain't hurting nobody, that's what I say. This is the Yakuza we're talking about. Hurting people is what they do. You're gonna have to be more specific. I can be, uh... A dickhead, sometimes. We all have our own path. You are not called to the silence. To pursue it would be folly. This, um, way of the wang you spoke to him about? The way of the wang is long and hard and ribbed for her pleasure. I see. Well, good luck with that. There has been an incident, Mr. Wang. Smith, what are you doing here? You work for this beat? Nice lady, too? I am here on personal business. Kamiko has gone missing. The birthday girl. Does that mean no cake? It's gonna mean no balls for you if you don't shut your yammering mouth. Ah, oh, I see what's going on. The big boss's daughter got lost on your watch. Kamiko's soul has been temporarily placed in your care. Are, Are you, you serious? serious? It's really rather miraculous. That's not the word I would have chosen. I'm riding shotgun with this dimwit? Do you understand, Kamiko? Everything is going to be all right. Oh, <laughs> right, sure. I mean, this day's been fantastic so far. I lost my job, and then my boss tried to kill me, and now I'm stuck inside the head of some wannabe ninja! She's great. How long do we have to do this for? Look for me between my mountains. In the valley where the sun does not shine. Farewell for now. Dude. What? Her. I knew she was an idiot from the papers, but that gave me full body douche chills. You don't have a body. Details. She's a freak. And she was hitting on you. So we have a little history. I don't see what choice we have. She's offering us refuge. She's offering us a one-way ticket to Creeperville. Well, I'll be, if it isn't my old pal fuckface. Amiona says you're to come inside. What, no metal detector? Guess you don't need those when you're immortal. You are on sacred ground. I would appreciate it if you could respect that. And I would appreciate it if you choked on a peanut. We all have different struggles. Who is this girl? Oh, um, she's the daughter of the Yakuza's big boss. I see. So you have taken something precious to them. Believe me, I'd give her back if I could. You two don't get along? Oh, no, no, she's really, really wonderful. Don't get me wrong. But yeah, I want her the fuck out of my head. Can't, uh, handle the wang? <laughs> yeah, something like that, yes. Well, here on the mountain, we can definitely handle the wang. <laughs> I say what now? It is like a container. Only it can hold a person's soul. Wait, seriously? Why can't I live in there instead of with this idiot? She wants to know why you didn't put her in there. I need you to figure out what that little shit was working on. She sent regular reports, but I think she was holding out on me. Uh, of course I was holding out on you, you evil bitch. <laughs> What's so funny? Ah, uh, nothing. Private joke. I need you to go to her apartment in the city and bring me anything you can find that looks like science. Notebooks, lab equipment. Sounds like it requires a lot of initiative. Listen, you cocky piece of shit. I hired you to protect a very expensive piece of merchandise. You brought her back broken. 
Until she's fixed, your ass belongs to me! If I say I want a human bird feeder, you start shoving crumbs up your ass! Uh, that's colorful. Damn. I mean, wonderful. Have fun, you miserable piece of shit. Love you too, sweetie. I didn't expect you back so soon. Funny how efficient you can be when there's someone in your head yelling at you all the time. Do you have a problem with efficiency? So you and Kamiko are getting along then? I wouldn't call it getting along so much as getting through. Enough chatting, let's get on with it. The rock doesn't choose the river, nor the river the rock. Yet neither would exist without the other. Tell him to lay off the cryptic wisdom and make my stupid potion already. Kamiko says you're full of shit. Oh, I doubt that very much. Okay, she said to lay off the cryptic wisdom and make the stupid potion already. That's my girl. You don't think any part of his energy might still be in this thing, do you? Oh, you mean like maybe your old friend could magically but heartbreakingly speak to you from across the grave? You think? Wait, shh. What? Listen. What am I listening to? The sound of gullibility. You have to catch me and give me that cure! Oh, that's... Ah, uh, inconvenient. You idiot! You let me get away! Easy with the insults, lady. Let's not forget who's driving this bus. How are things with your new roommate? Oh, you know, it's great as long as she keeps her mouth shut. I have to ride around in this cesspool of your mind all day and not talk about it? I wish I had skin so I could crawl out of it! You pompous, oversexed idiot! She agrees. Mm, I very much doubt that. Please. Treat her with respect and kindness, Lo Wang. She is very dear to me. Oh, look, someone with manners. Shocking. I'm sure you two will find a way to put aside your differences in the name of the greater good. If by greater good you mean me getting my money, then I heartily agree. Money is an illusion used to hypnotize small minds. But it sure helps when you're trying to buy a bottle of good whiskey. Looks like you're growing up nicely. Who are you, my creepy uncle? No, I'm the cool uncle who sneaks you beer and lets you drive his pickup. How long will that keep happening? I can't tell. Yeah, you can tell me. I'm a ninja. Do you enjoy being an idiot? Mezu, you may be a supernatural pervert, but you had your sister's number. She tried to kill you? What a surprise. Not the first woman to put a hit out on me. I believe we have an understanding. And hello, Kamiko. It's good to finally meet you, even if it is through this... Lesser creature. Fuck you very much, you miserable piece of shit! I oughta... Yeah, she's very touched. You got some pictures you weren't supposed to get. I'm practicing my art. Oh, that's a good one. Hand them over, Picasso. Fuck you!